Good morning, fans of Privateer FX. 23rd Jan here, coming at you with the European Open. We like Aussie lower again. BOJ came out this morning, 4.30 a.m., for those of you that were up. Neutral, nothing really happened. Dollar yen went down to 55, now we're back at 78. Not too much to see here. Aussie printed a, a marginal new high last night up at 28. Now it's come back down at 88. It's bearish engulfing through through 79.80. We like short Aussie, as we mentioned yesterday. This has turned out to be a bit of a patience trade, but we still like it. There's some tariffs that went out against uh, China and South Korea overnight, especially in the solar space. This kick in the balls to China should hurt the Aussie. Aussie Yen, same type of chart. Made that new high. Now we had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Way back here in October, eight, nine, ten highs around this 89, 10 area. Looks like we're going to bearish engulf today. Start heading lower. This Aussie trade looks better if equities turn. They had a boomer yesterday. Netflix crushed it. So we had all the technology companies higher. We have the oil companies and energy companies higher. This trend line is important. Comes in today at 28.17. We'll see. Equities can't just go up forever. Markets don't do that. But boy, that was a bit of a boomer yesterday, kind of at the close, for no real reason. Cable, we printed 140.03. This is interesting. First time since Brexit, we traded the 140 handle. These two lows over here on these two important lows, 140.05 and 140.12. A careful short here is probably not a bad idea using this 140.20, the death knock of this, um, this line, as your stop. Perhaps look for a little reach over 140.04, between 140.04 and 14. Sell some, 20 stop. Sounds like a pretty pretty good plan to me. Uh, what else? Cryptos are lower. We want to stick our bids back in. 9,500, 8,500, 7,200. Three tranches for Bitcoin. Or if you're an Ethereum fan, same idea. Go with 910, 810, 750. Once you get long, try and sell 80% of the position at some sort of 10% point away from your entry. So then you have core long at a very good average for the bottom drawer. This is our standard play in the cryptos. Bitcoin, if you look at it on the dailies, is in a downtrend, no doubt about it but we still believe Bitcoin is not going away and getting cheap Bitcoins and trading into a cheaper average is the best way to handle this volatility. All right, we'll leave you, leave you guys with that. Focus is Aussie left-hand side today, Aussie yen left-hand side. We're still looking at dollar Swiss top side with rates where they are. Put that back up. 96.40 was the high yesterday twice. 96.66. These are these are two very good levels. But pre ECB, we're in sort of trading mode, not trending mode in dollar Swiss. So there will be resistance 97 the figure, and then there will be even more resistance 97.50 on this 200-day moving average. So we are trading it from the long side not investing in it. Good luck out there, gentlemen. Talk to you guys in New York Open. Ciao.